Hello and welcome to the second devlog for the Equinox Hunt, a stealth roguelite game. In the last devlog I stopped right before dev play. Well, we got accepted and we were given a stand where we could display a demo of our game. The people there were amazing, lots of great feedback from developers. We also gained a lot of knowledge from the presentation that were held there and we met new developers and learned about new games. Based on the feedback from DevPlay and our team's experience, we decided to change some stuffs. But the most important thing was to change from 2D to 3D. We've kept the top-down perspective and went with this because Mihai had experience with 3D modeling and texturing, and Marianne said that 3D would help a lot in the long run. After this big change, we've started to prepare the rod for the alpha version. We've called this stage planning for alpha. We've had to wait for Unity 2080.3 to be released because we needed the change made uh, to the terrain system. So during this stage, I polished the GDD and fixed any problems that appeared during our talks or from the feedback. Mariam planned the core system of the game and how the other features will be built around them. Mihai researched 3D animations. And once Unity 2018.3 arrived, in December we started working on the game. After that we've changed our schedule to sprints and started having a constant workflow for the alpha version. A sprint lasts for a week, at the end of which we gather to talk about what we've done and what's next in the line. Well, our progress in the first quarter of 2019 resulted in uh, the core systems being developed and also most of the features needed for the alpha build. 3D models being made for the first map, the one that will be presented in the alpha version. We changed the technologies used for rigging the characters in our game, a thing that set us back a little. And we've also started doing marketing to grow the community and showcase our progress on the game. We've also launched the game's website where you could sign up for the newsletters, thus making the progress transparent to the community. We're trying to be present on as much social media platforms as possible. But for now, we're focusing on covering multiple social media such as Facebook and Twitter with weekly updates, YouTube with devlogs, Twitch with game dev live streams, and Discord where we can talk directly with you. For now, we're trying to use a newsletter and Reddit while being active on other social media platforms. I think that sums up everything. Right now we're working to bring the alpha on our Discord server and that's all I can say for now. See you on the next vlog.